Hey family, welcome to Scorpio Intuitions. If this is your first time on my channel, go ahead, like, and subscribe. Hit that notification button. And if it's not, hey, my beautiful family, welcome back. All right, we're going to dive into this energy. But first, most high, thank you for my beautiful, powerful collective. Anything that is hindering them or that's burdening them, we ask you to lift them from them. Victory is our portion. We walk in it. We receive it. It is so. Everything is not letting me be great, family. Mm. All right, let's get into this energy. Okay, most high, what's coming towards our powerful collective messages of clarity and truth? Ooh. First thing we have is devil in a red dress. So with this, I feel like there could be um, a female energy, a feminine energy, that a toxic feminine energy that could be uh, watching you, lingering, wanting to make a move towards you. Um, I got a freak in the morning, freak in the evening. So I feel like a uh, collective, this could be a female energy that that wants some type of, they could want some type of entanglement with you, or it's like they're, this is somebody that wants to seduce you, but it's for their own, um, for their own, uh, own reasons, messages of clarity, most high spirit, messages of clarity, it says, Friends, associates, cousins, aunties. Mm. Devil in a dress, freak in the morning, freak in the evening. Friends, associates. This could be somebody uh, collective that I feel like could know one of your family members. And I feel like this could be somebody who wants to kind of intrude. I want to say intrude on your life. Somebody wants to be down. And I feel like it doesn't matter how they get down, they want to be down with you. This is, it's giving me groupy energy, but it's like this person could know somebody in your family, somebody, uh, uh, or, or some friends of yours, messages of clarity, or I feel like there's some people that know you, this person could be watching, could be watching you wanting to come in in some type of seductive, seducing type of energy, wanting to, um, wanting to get in your world. It's like somebody come in, want to befriend you, but if they feel like you could be attracted to them, they'll try to come at you with that type of angle. Messages of clarity. Yeah, this is somebody who feels that they're not enough. They have self-esteem issues. This person is very jealous. Um, they they, they self-sabotage situations. This could be an old friend too. I feel like for some of y'all collective, you know how you have friends and you could feel like your friends could be attracted to you. So they feel some type of way, but also they jealous of you. I know it's a lot of emotions, but this is, person is kind of emotional. And I feel like this is this could be an old friend or, or a friend of an associate or family that, that they're attracted to you, but they're still jealous of you because they feel like they don't have what you have to bring to the table. So this person wants to come in and kind of like, put their self on you. And then we got healthy choices, healthy choices in love and life, self-worth. This person doesn't know their worth. What do you mean, Mercy? Like, this is the type of person that they will th they will sacrifice their body to get temporary pleasures or to feel something. This is somebody that could be very promiscuous. Um, they feel that the way to get what they want is through their body or what they can offer physically. This person doesn't feel that they are uh, worthy enough without giving themselves. And then we have Cupid's arrow, have faith, love is coming. And because it's under associates, this could be somebody that, like I said, I still feel that somebody that, that knows somebody that you know uh, wants to come in and wants to have some type of relationship with you at this time. It's the energy of wanting to, it's a groupy energy. Like, I just want to be down. Whatever you want me to do, I do it. You feel me, Scorpio? I told you, man, they, they own you, baby. They own you. Messages of clarity and truth from our beautiful, powerful Scorpio collective. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, Spirit says this is the energy of you holding back from somebody. I feel like if somebody comes in a and 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 like a lustful energy, a uh, Scorpio, I feel like if this person has already came to you, I feel like you you've been you kind of like dodging them. You kind of pull your energy back, like. No, I don't I ain't what I want, you feel me? And if I do want it, I don't want that from you. It's like that type of energy. Somebody that's coming off too desperate, too thirsty. And I feel like right now, uh, Scorpio Collective, you're in this energy where you're not fucking with nothing toxic. It's like if I could if I could foresee an issue, I'm not about to deal with it. And right now this this needy energy it is 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 going to cause some type of codependent uh energy towards you. Like somebody's trying to latch on to you because they feel like there's a lot of abundance coming your way. So they're trying to cling on before you skyrocket. And Scorpio, you like, uh uh, bitch, I am not having no more uh I'm not taking on no mental issue people or <laughs> not about to let your issues be mine. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Damn, that just flew out. Yeah. Okay. So we got the Knight of the the Knight of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles with this Cupid in love, and then we had the Ace of Pentacles. So I feel like right now you got a lot of love coming your way because people are seeing you, uh, and people seeing you financially secure. People are studying you right now to see what is your next moves. People are trying to see where you get your money from, and they want to come in as if they all lovey dovey like they down. And I feel like. So for some of y'all, there's a lot of friends, associates, cousins, aunties, family members that are going to try to come back in and rekindle something. They're going to want to start working with you. They're going to they're gonna be like, well, won't you come be a, get a have a business with me? It's because it's because they see money around you, Scorpio. They see some type of abundance. They see stability. Yeah. Yeah, they see st uh, a stability around you, and I feel like they they are trying to come in because they want to work with you now. Now these could be the same people, associates, uh, family members that you could feel like jealous. So you really don't fuck with you like that. But it's something about how you produce and whatever you're doing right now. People are seeing you produce, and they want to be down. It's like they they don't want the train to leave them behind. Messages of clarity and truth. That's what it is. It's something that you could have talked to them about or, or something like that. And like they keep seeing you elevating. It's like, dang, Scorpio be laying low, be doing them. But they always, but but it's like it's something about you. You always stay on your feet no matter what situation is coming. Not just that, but you're not the person that, that always want a handout or, or ask somebody for this and that. They're like, Scorpio ain't never really asked me for nothing. Scorpio always, you know, was in a place of giving. How are they always in that place? And then we have the King of Swords. So this King of Swords, I feel like these are people in the past that you could have already cut cut out or you have not been like fucking with like that. And now they've been watching you in the background and they're coming back in. Yeah, they've been watching you be this this queen of uh this queen of wands. You've been you've been uh being creative, you've been uh acting uh you've been getting things done. And it's like getting things done on the low, like not really boasting, not really putting it out there. But people are watching you and they're seeing little by little that whatever it is, it's like Scorpio over there getting money. Let me see what Scorpio doing. And when they say devil in a red dress, this is somebody, this is a sneaky energy that wants to come and plot so that they can know, know what you're doing. This is a nosy person too. Yeah, I can't make this up. See, this is somebody studying you. They trying to see how are you getting what you get. Yeah, they're seeing that you're busy. They're seeing that you're moving around. And it's the energy of, wait, Scorpio doing something. Let, let's see. And I feel like somebody about to come in and take a risk on, um, like, trying to see what it is that you're doing. And then the reason why it's a risk, because I feel like this person know that y'all probably, like, you, you probably don't, you're not too fond of this individual. Messages of clarity and truth. You're not too fond of this individual. Yeah. Somebody's about to reach out to you. Somebody that feels like they're not enough. Somebody that is jealous of you. Somebody that, that envies you to a certain extent because they feel like they should be where you are, not knowing where you are. <laughs> Messages of clarity and truth. Messages of clarity and truth. One time. Yeah, this is, uh, 
Yeah, this is somebody right now that I feel like you used to be loyal to. This is somebody that, that I feel like used to be in your world or had the opportunity to be in your world, but they, uh, they could have fussed it up. And now they're trying to see how can they come back in because it's something that you're doing and they know you are always uh, business minded or, or goal oriented. And right now, whatever they're watching you do, they're starting to see some type of financial funds that could be connected. And right now with vision, Spirit says, under make sure your vision is clear because you're going to be seeing things there. And, and, and it's like you're about to come into this uh, air into this arena Scorpios to where you're going to visualize something happening and you're going to think of somebody in like a scenario and that scenario going to start playing itself out and I have to say family please be mindful of what you manifest because I don't know about y'all but you could think something and it happens the next day I don't know if y'all been experiencing that but I did that the other day and thought about something and when I tell you it was happening like the same day. So spirit is saying, be mindful on what you focus on because what you are manifesting is coming to fruition very, very fast. And more so because we are at this breaking point, this separation point where I tell you it's really whatever you want collective, you can have it. So be mindful what you focus on, focus on those things that you desire and not what you don't desire because it's coming, I swear to you. And it's gonna get real, like creepy but it's gonna be cool though creepy cool <laughs> all right collective i love you love yourself remember we are the shit that don't stink uh go follow me on instagram storm underscore swift and swift underscore intuitions